Well, this ain't really precious metal related. Let's see what we got behind it. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I am Polly Buck and I sure do appreciate you being here with me again today. Uh, not April Fool's Day. I actually got back home from vacation yesterday, April Fool's Day. Today being April 2nd of 2022 and I got a little bit of mail but before we get to that we'll talk about this alligator head really quick. My son wanted it. We ran into it at a gift shop. He said, Dad, you should get this for your desk. So... He talked me into it. We picked it up. I'll set it in the background of a video. It is pretty cool. Um, actually, my brother-in-law and his son went while we were in Florida on a gator hunt. They got two of them. So I'm looking forward to eating some of that meat here in the near future. But today, what we're going to be talking about are these right here. This is what came in the mail when I was gone. I ordered these. They were on a pre-order. Um, this is going to be the second coin in the Street Fighter series. This is the Chun-Li. And the lighting is just terrible. There it goes right there. This is the Chun-Li. So second in the series. The Street Fighter series started with the Ryu. I can put that video right there if you did not see that one. Um, these are the same. These are going to be your 15,000 limited mintage. I bought mine from Bold Precious Metals before I left to go on vacation. And they arrived today. I'm trying to get you a decent look at it. But it just wants to stay... Blurry. There it is. So these arrive today. You're going to have the Capcom, which did these with the Perth Mint. And you have Chun-Li getting ready to do her finishing maneuver. And that's your reverse. And then your... Oh, it's a little... I thought it was a capsule, but it's not. It's just from my hands. On your obverse, you're going to have the Queen, naturally. Queen Elizabeth II, one dollar. Tuvalu, one ounce, four nines, fine, 2022. Perth Mint does a great, great job as usual. You get these in your hand. They got that kind of cloudy... Oh, wants to pick up everything in the background. It's got that cloudy kind of finish almost like a matte finish on the fields and then the mirror proof like finish on the queen and same here you're going to have that proof like on different portions of the character and then your matted fields that's a good look at it right there is kind of what you're going to see holding in hand so again, this is second in the series. This character actually didn't come out until the Street Fighter II released. <clears throat> um, as Bold was saying in their description of the coin, uh, this, this is going to be a hot series from what they say. I continue to say the same thing, this one being the second in the series, and they are out of stock. Bold has no more of them. Um, if they get more, I do couldn't tell you but i would surely say that the price will and has gone up on these i think they released around 33 or 32 dollars an ounce per coin uh, i didn't do any background checks on them i don't know if they're selling on the secondary market yet i haven't seen them on i guess as far as instagram i haven't seen them on a youtube auction uh, a lot of times you'll see them on ebay before they even release but i think it's going to be another cool series uh i'm going to collect it like i said the first one was rayu this one's the chun li the second one for 2022 
Um, again, back in that first video, there's so many characters they could do. They have the potential to do 15 to 20 coins if they wanted to, or are they going to stick to the, you know, standard 10 or 12 and call that good, call that a series, and then maybe come out with a series two? I don't know. It's just fun for me and I, maybe anybody else to wait and see what's next. Uh, do me a favor. If you're new to the channel and you like things like this, hit that subscribe button. I got a lot of watch time from non-subscribers and it's costing you nothing but doing nothing good for anybody out there. It gives more people a chance to see videos like this that I do. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell button. Give me a thumbs up on this video and leave a comment down below. Let me know, did you get the first in the series? Did you get the Rayu coin? Um, do you think collecting silver just flat out sucks? Let me know. Um, as far as where premiums are and have been, realistically, these are not a bad buy um, considering silver eagles and maples, their prices. Eagles are 40, 42 to 40 to 42 dollars. Maples, 36, 38 dollars. Um, even for stacking, I mean, right now, these aren't bad to hang on to. Even if you weren't looking to flip them. Um, some of these will go. I'll try and hang on to a couple myself. But realistically, a lot of these are going to get sold off. And I go from there. So, like I said, do me a favor. Leave a comment down below and let's chat about it. I will catch you all on the next one. Thanks, everybody.